Si pangit niya sa ano, panoorin. Ito na. So yon. Let's talk about the second issue. Wala na kalimutan ko din. Second issue. Mm-mm. The second issue is about selfishness. Diba, most of us, ginasabi natin na ano na, sa friends na lang tayo lumalapit, sa friends na lang tayo nagsasabi ng problema natin kasi hindi naman tayo naiintindihan ng mga magulang natin. Hindi naman sila nakikinig sa atin. Are we sure? Are we sure na hindi sila nakikinig? Well, in fact, hindi rin naman natin alam yung mga pinagdaraanan nila, actually. So, same-same lang. Diba, she? Hindi rin naman na, hindi rin naman nila sinasabi kung gaano kahirap yung pinagdaraanan nila every day. Nagpapakalakas sila. Nag ano yung nagpapakita sila, na malakas sila para hindi tayo ma problema. Yes, and even though you feel like there's parents ginya not listening. It doesn't mean you will dishonor them yeah. just because they don't know your problems. Just because that's not a reason. That's why Instead of thinking of yourself, now you think also of your parents. Did I even ever listen to them? If they're not listening to me, I should listen to them. Also, remember that God forgive us and sacrifice for our sins. How much for us we can forgive our parents that we are sinful, that God also died for them. That is why we should honor our parents, respect them, because you might regret it and If you don't respect them, the same goes to your daughters, your future daughters yes. or sons. They will do the same thing. Yes. Yeah, the golden rule, whatever. What? Do unto others. Do, <laughs> do unto others what others must do unto you. Ah, uh, others. So let's be careful. Yes. We are not. We are honoring our parents for the Lord, man. It's not for ourselves, it's not for our parents, but it's for God. And because yes. we love God, we love our parents. That's why we need to honor and love our parents. Even to those abusive parents. No, abusive If parents. they are still honored, must soften ang kanilang heart. Imagine na lang, di ba? Imagine, Imagine na lang, na pag after all of these things, tapos tapos ng lahat, then we are together now with God. Imagine in heaven, in heaven. Wow, so be excited. there. Imagine na lang na yung mga paghihirap mo dito sa earth, including sa pag conquer mo ng grudge against your uh, parents. Diba? Are all worth it. Yes. Let us stop focusing on ourselves. Let's start focusing on God. Because He deserve it. deserves it. Mm-hmm. Because He's not just our Creator. He is not just the one who gives everything to us. He's not just the one who loves us but because he is god he is the lord of all and he is the king of kings he is god he deserves it and we are just nothing yes we should uh, we should start focusing on god rather yes. than focusing on ourselves kasi kung mag-focus tayo sa sarili natin walang mangyayari di ba self so si nisel sel you know ano ako maghawa yari <laughs> Okay, guys. So, ayun. Dito kasi kami sa, ano, ngayon, sa prayer garden. It's part it's of our, ano. It's us. Us and the angels. Unseen creatures. I understand those kids na bitter pagdating, pag pinag-uusapan ng, ano, ang parents. Because, you know, marami silang trauma na pinagdaanan, pinagdadaanan. Ganun. Kaya hindi rin natin sila dapat i-judge na, Uy, you're not honoring your parents, that's bad. No, we should no, not do not. that. Oh. Hindi natin alam kung, ano, kung paano yung hirap na pinagdaraanan nila. And it takes time. You know, it takes time. It takes commitment and dedication. Yes. It takes time. And 
surrender. Full surrender. And full surrender. Ganon. If you're not in God, it's impossible to honor your parents wholeheartedly. Yes. Yes, because God will is the one that will let us realize all our mistakes. Mm-hmm. But as a guess, we go. I so we need to go to God. Mm-hmm. He will surrender our all, then He will. It's very easy na to honor our parents. Ah, uh-huh. pero hindi ka dapat na pressure sa pagsunod sa Panginoon. Yes. Oh, kasi the more the more na ma-pressure ka, the more na mag mag-exert ka ng effort. Na, oh, I have to do this. I have to go to church. I have to True. pray every day. I have to read the Bible. Tapos hanggang sa matak matakan na ka, tapos magsawa ka na. Hindi dapat ganoon. Accept. I-accept, i-acknowledge mo yung i-acknowledge natin na hindi natin kaya sumunod yes. sa Panginoon. Only God can give us power to continue. Um, Oo, to follow Him. To continue following Him. Giselle. Giselle, what can you say about following Jesus? You follow Him because you love Him, not because that is the good thing to do. Mm-hmm. Yes. But how to love Jesus? Full surrender. How to full surrender? How to full surrender? You ask for the Holy Spirit and with the guidance of the guidance of God, then you can fully surrender. Because if we just um, surrender by our own human effort, nothing will happen. Yes. We need really the Holy Spirit and the guidance of God. Then you yes. can fully surrender and feel the peaceful, peace, peaceful heart. You know what, guys? The more we come to Jesus Christ, the more na nakikita natin lahat ng pagkukulang natin. Mas nakikita natin kung sino talaga tayo. Nawawala yung ano, nawawala yung pride, nawawala yung pagiging mataas ng tingin sa sarili. Nawawala yung pagiging tikalon. <laughs> Kasi the more na pumupunta lumalapit tayo sa Panginoon, the more na mas nakikita natin na we are help- helpless. Now we are helpless. <laughs> Ganon. So, to end. God, God really wants na ano na magkaroon tayo ng eternal salvation, ng eternal life. Pero paano nga ba, di ba? Di ba nga paglapit sa kanya? God wants to invade our heart. Yes, he wants to change it. But, nasa atin kasi yung willingness. We have the freedom to choose. Yes, our, our will to, to come to Him is the key for Him to enter our heart. Ganon. Now, if mag-ano lang tayo, magpa dungol dumo lang tayo and gusto natin talaga kung ano gusto natin mangyari, hindi makaka-work yung Panginoon sa atin. Hindi niya magagawa yung mga bagay na gusto niyang gawin sa buhay natin. So, in relation, yes. in relation to our to forgiving our parents. Wala tayong kakayanan. Wala tayong kakayanan to forgive and get to forgive. It is only God's power na ibibigay niya sa atin. Because mercy is in Him and not in us. Ganon. I know kung gaano ka burden yun na may grudge ka, especially sa family mo. Na yung family mismo ang nagbibigay ng ano, nagbibigay ng reason kung bakit ganyan ka. ba? Diba? Ganito tayo. I know in our hearts, deep in our hearts, gusto natin na ano, mabago yun. Why not come to God? Nothing is impossible in Him. Yes. He's waiting in our heart. Yes, He is the just door waiting. Is inside. He's just waiting. Hindi siya nag-stop. Hindi siya nag-stop na ano na mag-talk sa atin. Hindi talaga siya nag-stop. Kaso hindi nga lang natin ma-identify ang voice niya dahil hindi natin siya kilala. Yes. So, if this is the time, 
it's the time. Yes, if you ever see this video. YouTube account. If you ever see this video. Yes. Start na. Na ano. Start to. Yeah, honor your parents. Start to honor, honor God, and also start to acknowledge your pain. Then allow God to enter your heart. Yes. Jesus can deliver us from our sins. So, yun guys. Nisa, what can you say as a conclusion? Sen, she is deep thinking. Go. Listen. Sen. Sen. That we should honor God by respecting our parents. Yeah. That's all. That's all. And then, guys. Bye. God bless.